right. Your name, age, and why'd you pop your balloon? I'm Cece, I'm 28. You gotta speak a little bit louder, louder, Cece. You heard my name though. No, nah, well, I did. Okay. I'm just saying for the people. So the reason I said no is because he, he talk a lot and he's very sassy. And I, I'm not with the, and the, the nose ring is killing me. The, the, the four, um, he got four ear piercings. Why? No reason. The hat is backwards still. The, look, at the, look at the shoes. And he want to get up here and talk all that shit to everybody. Don't, me and him going to be going like this every day. What's up, guys? It's your boy once again. <laughs> with another episode of Pop the Balloon. Man, y'all know these things get outrageous. So many of them. I was just watching one from the Jamaican. And it was funny, but I just couldn't understand what the guys were saying. So I had to jump on this one. And I ran up on um, Meg McQueen pop up in this thing. Y'all know this dude's hilarious, right? So I had to get him. I had to check my man out, man. And this shit was hilarious. So y'all kick back. <laughs> Hit that subscribe, like, and share. And then just enjoy this. Just enjoy it for the entertainment, man. You know what I mean? So, let's get it. Let's welcome our next single guy. What's your name, age, and what you do? <laughs> My name is Megan McQueen. I'm 31, and I'm a comedian on YouTube. Okay. Wow. What are some activities you're into? Shit, I just like to work and self-develop, stay focused. Stay out the way for real and just help my niggas who help me, you know what I'm saying? Support me, that's it. Just try to get back to the world in any way I can, you know? What are some qualities you like in your woman? Before he go anywhere, this chick over here, this the one. Now, something is up with her. Now, earlier she said she was a doctor. A doctor. But watch how she try to act so hood and hard it doesn't even come off right but just pay attention to it. that's why i want to bring some attention to her and the first girl you know something ain't right just characters all right mm, number one is respect and some and submissiveness for sure before anything what are some deal breakers <laughs> if you're not submissive I, I don't want no combative ass Argumentative ass. I don't want no. Oh yeah, I'm a self. I'm a. I'm a independent woman. I don't need no man. I don't want nothing. Try to move this head. You know <laughs> Whoa. All right. Look like we have a couple of pop balloons. Let's go. Your name, age, and why'd you pop your balloon? Sachi, 27, and I'm an artist. Um, and you ain't independent. I don't need no man, huh? That's what you is. Because you, when you pop your balloon, that shit hit me in my yeah. nose, nigga. That shit pissed me off a little bit. <laughs> no, yeah. listen. Okay, not necessarily, but at the same time, like, I feel like I give boss. And I'm very dominant. I don't give a fuck what you give. But, I, but you know what the thing is with me? I need somebody that knows how to tame me real good. So you what? have to Are know you a how fucking to. caged animal? Why the fuck? I don't know. Whatever she is, but look at the... The BBL ratio to the little leg ratio. Ladies, I thought we got past that. 2024, the legs have to match. The legs have to match. No exceptions. None. But, yeah. Let's go. I yeah, gotta tame you. I am a cage animal. That's a problem. You need therapy. No, okay? I've been to therapy. Niggas don't need to tame a woman. <laughs> we tame. We do. We do it so much in our no, everyday life already. Why the fuck habitat. can I speak, leopard. please? No, it is leopard. When I when I come I home, when I come home, leopard. right? When I come home, I don't want to have to tame my woman. No. If I'm providing for you and I'm doing everything I'm supposed to be doing as a man, right? Mm -hmm. Why the fuck would I want to come home after dealing with all that shit and then have to tame my girl? Like, as if you some animal. It's not like you have to tame me in a sense of, like, if there's something going on every single day. It's It has to do with, like, you know, a day-to-day -day thing as far as, like, you know, 
I might be in a bad mood or I might be trying to do something that I want to do and you're telling me not to do what I want to do and I might want to do it. So that might be combative for me because I'm very bossy. Oh, I'm very bossy. I'm sorry. I like things my way or the fucking highway. That's just what it is. And I'm just me. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, hit the road. <laughs> Would she be somebody that would be your type? Fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, the fuck, the fuck I need a tame and anybody tame? Nigga, this shit crazy. And she talking about, oh, I'm 27, oh you know what I'm saying? Oh. And I like things my way or the highway with the whoop. Well, listen to me. This is why you're at a dating show inside of a studio right now, okay? Because you're still dealing with these issues, baby. You need to stop moving it like that, all right? Oh, and you will get a nigga, I promise you, because you already have but a look. I have a, I have a lot of them already. You have a way? I have a lot of So why aren't you with any of them? Because I'm here doing a show. This chick is 27. I think she lying. I think she lying about that age because it's like some time on this one right here. This one and that last one I pointed out earlier, they look like they got some age on them. They saying they're 27, but nah. And maybe it could be the, the, the work she had done on her face and the BBL making her look older now. Um, I mean, it could be the clothing too, but yeah, yeah. I don't. I mean, some people like it. I mean, so I ain't gonna knock it. Some people do love it. So, do your thing, cheetah, cheetah girl. Do your thing. Content creation business. Would you know anything about that? Wow, she telling him. Next, have a great day. That's, that's all he does. <laughs> Nigga, what? Nigga, I was like. <laughs> your name, age, and why did you pop your balloon? Hazel, and I'm 25. What did you say your name was? Hazel. Hazel, okay. Or Hayes, whatever. Um, I don't know. You just say you don't like independent women. I like getting money. I like, you know. That's great. You can get money. And at the end of the day, you know, it's I'm going to do what I have to do for me, you know? That's and great. And if you have, like, a problem with that, then it's not going to work. For sure. That's Would this I mean. be somebody that would be your type? I mean, no, because I feel like if you are too slow to understand what the fuck I was even saying when I said I don't want an independent woman, because she associated that with her not being able to get money. You oh. can get money and still be a woman that allows your man to lead. If you want to be some, and you can't just be in a solid relationship where a man is a leader. You want a leader as a man? Yeah. So how are you going to be an independent woman and also let a man lead? Because you said you had a problem with independent women. Because if I'm if I'm dealing with an independent woman, I don't need no man, then you're not gonna allow me to leave. She can still be independent and submissive. But you just like, say you she's don't like really not women. I, don't I think said she I don't understand. like an independent woman, I don't need no man. That's the attitude I don't like. Uh -huh. You ain't listen to that part though, huh? Then I can get my balloon back because I'm cool. <laughs> See, and that's a thing with a lot of young women now that don't understand a lot of the terminology. They think being independent, getting their, well, getting their money, making money, making is independent, and that's not what he's saying. And so, just like she misunderstood, he's like, I don't care if you get your money. I'm talking about being a submissive woman and the man leading. And she think, well, I want to be independent, but just like I told this woman that was married, you're not an independent woman. You're married, and it's like she couldn't understand that. I was like, you are solely dependent on someone else to help you because you're married. Regardless, you're not by yourself. Independence by yourself, doing it all by yourself, being by yourself. That's what independent is, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> like, he just lost right now. That's what she said, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's what she said, yeah. 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 I mean, she's a little cute girl. Like, like early, earlier, dude said, um, she just looked like regulars in Miami. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go on to our next pop balloon. Your name, age, and why'd you pop your balloon? Kaya, twenty-two. I literally just popped it because um, I don't know, like. A comedian is great. I love funny men. You're handsome, by the way. But Thank I just you. feel like sometimes, like I kind of like want a little more serious. Like I you know, I don't always want a joke to like come back and stuff like that. That's literally why. So. Yeah, I get you. Yeah, that's it. Would she be somebody that'd be your type? 
I like what like me. So if she don't like right. me, then she's not my type. Fellas, always like the ones that like you. It goes easier that way. That's all we talk about up here. Hi. 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 You have much for Your name, age, and why'd you pop your balloon? I'm Cece. I'm 28. You got to speak a little bit louder, louder, Cece. You heard my name, though. No, nah, well, I did. Okay. I'm just saying for the people. So the reason I said no is because he, he talk a lot, and he's very sassy, and I'm not with the and the, the nose ring is killing me. The, the, the four... Um, Look at this dude. He got man. four ear piercings. Why? No reason. The hat is backwards still. The, look at the look at the shoes. And he want to get up here and talk all that shit to everybody. Don't. Me and him going to be going like this every day. It's not going to work. And you know I keep that thing on me. <laughs> what she got juicy on the back of her pants? She's a little short. Like she's trying to come off like she's that that chick, you know, that hard chick. But uh, there's nothing about her says she's hard. You know, like cut it out, man. What she got juicy? Let's see that. Let's see that. Every day, it's not gonna work. And you know, I keep that thing on me. <laughs> yeah, she got right on the back of her pants on the butt. Now this the one says she's a doctor. And, you know, and that's crazy how we always talk about how um, even the good ones want to act like the ratchet ones. There we go right here. A doctor want to be ratchet. Got that thing on me. <laughs> now we're next. I don't even want to hear. I don't even want to hear a joke that you're going to say. Why? Next. You're just able to say whatever the fuck you want to say, but you don't want to hear what I say. Because you know I'm finna roast your little short, thick. <laughs> <laughs> fucking buzz butterball. Let me they let me finish what coming. I'm saying. How old did she say she was? It don't matter. Why does it not matter? It don't matter. Tell me what your age is. It don't matter. Why does it not matter? Because you, because you, how? She wouldn't say her age on the other one when the other guys came through. But I thought she was about to say it on here. But she, for some reason, she won't say that age. So she might be lying too. She might be in them high thirties. I mean mid thirties. Old are you? Wrong. Tell me. You you she gotta be an old motherfucker if you if you afraid to tell me the age. See you see that you see that talk a lot shit I'm talking about. You just said a bunch of shit, but you don't want me to say nothing back because you know I'm finna fry your ass. That's why. I know you don't because you know I'm finna fry your little small fry ass. That's why. Take that pen out your titties, okay? Take that. Why you got that damn pen in between in between your titties? Okay, for sure. Put that bitch right back in. Okay, cool. And how old are you still? You you're not gonna answer the question. Now start watching her facial demeanor. As she know he's gonna roast her, but he, he, I got, I give him credit. He didn't go, he didn't go too hard on her. No, Cause you, yeah, friends. okay, I know. Cause you just, you just wanted to talk all your shit, and you didn't want to give the comedian a chance to roast your ass. I get it. Okay, that was a smart move. I like that. Okay. I got a on type. the chest. Fuck no, nigga. Damn. You talk too motherfucking much, man. <laughs> Just like you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> got to move a little short ass out my way, man. You talk too goddamn much. I need this bitch to shut up, nigga. <laughs> Now you see he called me a bitch. Now, 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 now see now, now she wanna get all real. Where's KK? They done call him sassy and all this other stuff. KK, who's he talking to? See now she being all extra. So he still he now no one said anything when she was calling him all sassy. So y'all know what that means. They call you sassy, right? That's all feminine and you know whatever, but it ain't nothing masculine or manly. So he referenced the B word, not directly calling her one, just in converse, like gesture. And now she's trying to change it. Oh, oh, listen, look. But you ladies, like she sat there and what, went at him for like a few minutes now. But you don't get to dictate how it comes back. That's the thing. That's why I tell you, don't say nothing to me if you ain't ready for it. Because I'm not going to come back the way you came back. I'm going to come back the way I want to come back. So, and that'll be based on how I took that, what you said to me. And then sometimes it's like, hey, I'll shut your butt up. So, take that. Take that. He's still interviewing me, please. All right. Get all back right, in your spot. Come on. Come on. And that's why I popped my balloon. Yeah, one more pop balloon. Are we doing? Okay. Yeah. Look, at, look, look at the shape. Look at this. 
the BBLs on you short people and it's like an egg turned sideways. Now, I'm not even going to try to be bashing. I ain't bashing nothing. But I'm just pointing out things. When y'all getting these BBLs, man, you got to make sure that you're doing what you're supposed to do to make sure these curves come in right. Like these women right here, they look as natural as you can think of. I don't know. She might have a little bump in the back. She got the low booty thing here. But the sister here, she shaped up nice for her height and everything. And the other young lady. But these two on the end, BBLs are terrible, terrible. And as they get older, they are going to look a hot mess, man. They already like they're about five foot. So they're going to look a hot mess. And she already knees and stuff, hit, thighs, like there's no gap in between. Yeah. Not, not too good, ladies. Listen, Abby, I don't give a fuck. I, I don't. See, she don't have a lot of makeup on and stuff. <laughs> Tall. Here's the thing. I didn't, I didn't pop my... Oh, okay, okay. Your name, age, and why'd you pop your balloon? Okay, Abby Nicole, 25. I want to clarify why I kept it and then why I popped it. I kept it because I felt like when he first started speaking, he matured from what I, from me knowing him. <laughs> Look at this fool. I felt like, okay. He started, <laughs> see. <laughs> <laughs> no, I felt like he matured for sure because I've known him for a while. So I'm like, hmm, maybe wrong timing. Maybe he could. Then he started the beat. The, nah, I can't do it. Mm -mm. That's it. You know I love you, though. Would she be somebody that ought to be your type? I mean, look, like I said, I like what like me. So, you know, if you don't yeah. like me, then. It is what it is. You're not I my type. I love you, though. Then why'd you pop the balloon? Because you called her, like, all her name. You gonna call me out my name? Then that's gonna be smart. Have I, I ever called? Have I ever called you out your name? But what if you just but, did but, it? But wait, did but I? Just did, did I ever call you out your name? Yes Honestly, or no? No. Okay, so why you popped the balloon? Just because you heard somebody else talking shit to me, and I didn't get a chance to talk shit back. And so when I say a joke about it, now you're going to pop the balloon because of yeah, other people's opinions. because at the end of the day, if it, even if you piss me off, you're talking about respect and submissive, I'm not going to call you a pussy-ass nigga if you piss me off. But what that got to do with you and me? I'm just saying, okay, I'm giving you my reasoning. If you feel like it doesn't have to do with that, I feel like if you're, you did that right there, I wouldn't put you doing it past me. You and the thing with that is they know each other, so they have an uh, understanding. She's saying she would never come at him this way, so he would never talk to her that way. The little chick, as soon as he got in front of her, she just went off on him. The earrings, the nose ring, the shoe, like she went at his outfit, his shoes, his hat. Like she just went from head to toe on him. So that's a different thing. Like you ladies, look, man, if you can't take it, don't start. You don't start because you don't know what's going to come out the other person's mouth. I, I'm just going to say that. That's why I tell women, like, y'all need to chill with that mouth. You might think you're being funny, but somebody can hurt your feelings real bad. You get what I'm saying? So it's like, especially if I made you feel threatened like that, or if I made you, if I pushed you to that, if you can't control your mouth, it's going to just go left. Because well, now you're really going to call me this, now I'm going to call you something else, then you're going to call me this. It, it, yeah, but I don't know. The the, the bitch wasn't, wasn't used in the sense of okay, so oh this that. is a bitch like it was more so like get this bitch out of here like it was just you know what i'm saying like i just just nigga talk but if you yeah, take it offensively i don't really care honestly yeah i know yeah. i know i still love yeah you that's how you have to be man just you don't care about all that <laughs> but unfortunately it looks like we didn't get a match i appreciate you for of course my nigga i appreciate you man hell yeah oh, wow man. Yeah, man, I just wanted to say that. My man be tripping me out. I watch some of his stuff on um on all this other like YouTube and Instagram and stuff. So the thing to understand with this is some of these ladies aren't here for the real thing. They here like that first girl right there. She's trying to get on with some social media stuff and all this and that. Uh, I think majority of them want the big man right there. Let's just be honest. And he don't want not one of them. So Ladies, pick somebody. But anyway, hope y'all enjoyed it. It's your boy. I'm up out of here. Y'all take care. Peace. And I'm out of here.